And while it's easy enough for some people to go out and get the shot when the call comes, it's nearly impossible for others. Plenty of seniors can't leave their homes, and some have contacted us saying they have no idea what to do. Ten of your side's Kayla Gaskin is looking into this issue tonight. Getting a homebound senior out and about is definitely a process for some. It even requires an ambulance. For families that reached out to us, they said, wouldn't it be easier if the shots could be brought to them? Health officials say that's easier said than done. When homebound seniors register with the state to get a vaccine, there's a disability box they can click, but turning the checked box into a home visit doesn't appear to be happening for many, including Rosie Lucas of York County. This is Rosie. Rosie, 94 years old, suffers from brain tumors. They're not cancerous, but they have taken a massive toll on her quality of life. She's eligible for the COVID-19 vaccine, but getting to a clinic to get the shot is near impossible. So, for months, her daughter has been trying to figure out how to have someone administer the shot at home. She does have seizures, mm -hmm. so, and I don't have to have her sitting in a wheelchair, pushing her in the line, standing outside, or whatever the situation may be. And, and put her more at risk. Officials with York County tell us they have yet to finalize a system to reach homebound seniors in the county, which explains Rosie's struggles. York County recently entered into a regional partnership with the Peninsula Health District, Zentera, Riverside Health Systems, and more to figure out vaccination issues like reaching homebound seniors. That's a needed thing that should have been on the books at the beginning, but that's okay, you know. Uh, it's never too late to start. York County and other Hampton Road cities appear to be late to the game. Chesterfield County already launched a program with their fire and EMS to get vaccines to their homebound seniors. They even created a special email for the purpose, bedboundvax at chesterfield.gov. Winchester in Northern Virginia has a similar program in play. While York County figures out their approach, Rosie and others in similar situations wait. We want to get everybody vaccine. Well, we are everybody. I'm Kayla Gaskins, 10 on your side.